Right, so this is uh, Josh Whitfield then uh, doing task one, uh, unit one. Um, right, and Josh will go for P1 to start off with. Describe fitness requirements for achieving excellence in selective sports. So, which sports person have you picked? Um, Stephen Gerrard. Right, right, just go through the five fitness requirements then for him. Um, you'll need speed. Um, it's important for Stephen Gerrard to have speed because when he gets the ball, he needs to attack the other goal and um, he needs to try to score for him. Also, to beat other players to the ball as well. Um, right. He needs strength for his tackling and um, so he can get the ball again for his team. Um, also, he, need, he needs to push people off the ball, like tackling as well. He needs co coordination. Right. Because um, he can't just look at the ball and keep the ball, he's got to like, run and not look at it. So, he needs that for his coordination. And, like, um, so that's three, two more then. Yeah, um, power for his shots and also a tackle. He needs power to like get him off the ball. Um, One more. Uh, reaction time. Good. Because if the ball comes at him fast, he needs to react fast so he can control it and stuff. Why else might reaction time be important? Um, Right, fine. Right, we'll move on to P2 then. Describe three different fitness training methods used to achieve excellence in a selective sport. So, who's the person you picked from a different sport then? Roger Federer. Right, good then. Right, give me uh, three different training methods then. Um, he'll need to train on his um, strength and power for his serve and return and stuff. What sort of training might he do for that then? Um, his arms. I don't know which ones. Yeah. What sort of exercise might he do? Um, them ones. What's that uh, called? I don't know. Dumbbell? Yeah. What? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> right, is that something you can look up then? Right, is that strength and power? So what else? He can do fart like because he's running around. He's not just stop standing still. He needs to run back and forward. So he could do like, he could... Jog up a hill, um, jog along like a straight, and you could like jog down a, a steep hill. Good, right, next one. That, um, speed as well for his running as well. So he could like set some corns out and jog, like jog to one corn, sprint mm. back, jog to another corn, sprint back, because that's what he does when he's playing tennis. He, he needs to run and stuff. Right. So, like, right, so just on that strength and power one, if you have a look around the gym now, which, which machine might help that? Um, so have a quick wander around and have a quick walk. You could do rowing maybe. Right. And what that, else? That one there, I don't know. Right, show me it then. The pull down one. Right. Well, have a look what it's called then. The pull down. It's jump. Right. Do that one. So it pulls it down. Right, okay. So. So what muscle is that then? What? Uh, it does that one there. Right. Let's have a look on this muscle thing here. And find out which one it is. Which one is it there? His triceps. His lat latinus mus dorsi. Right, okay. And also, which other one did you just say then? Uh, his triceps. Right, okay. Um, So you had strength and power training, yeah. right? So which machine would you use again for that? The pull down one. Right. And what muscle is it testing? Uh, the biceps. No, no. The triceps. And, uh, A little bit of biceps, but. And uh, that pectorals. Have another quick look. Tatis humus. Tatis humus. Tatis humus. Tatis humus. And then the final bit. Dorsi. 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 So that's strength and power, and then second one, what's that one you said? Uh, fartlek. Fartlek, yes, yeah, so that was a good example. Third one? Uh, is speed. Speed, yeah, and again, a good example for that one. Right, fine. Do you want to do the merit part? Uh, yeah, I can try. Right, go on then, good. Uh, I've done Lionel Messi. Right, uh, Messi? Yeah, he'll need agility, because he's one of the best players in the world, so he'll need agility in a game. Um, Why, though? Because... Uh, he's good at ha like 
like skills and it's agility and skills and stuff. Right, next one then. Uh, speed, because he's one of the fastest players as well, as long as Cristiano Ronaldo. They'll need that in a football game to beat players, to get the ball, um, to like defend as well. Mm -hmm. He's like up front, he needs to like go back and defend for his team. Right. So they don't, so don't score and stuff. And he'll need power for his passing to save. If he's at one side at pitch and he's fast to other, yeah. he'll need power for that. And um, his clearances, if he's at the if he's in boxing, he's clearing it to get out. He needs to do that, and also for his shots and stuff on a target. So he right. Need power for that. Okay. Right then.